active and passive immunity objective to learn the two forms of natural immunity active and passive the immune response produced when an antigen enters the body naturally without the aid of medical intervention is known as natural immunity natural immunity can be one of two types either natural active or natural passive when pathogens such as bacteria viruses or toxins enter the body and cause an infection they will activate a natural response that is referred to as natural active immunity immune cells such as b cells and t cells will attack the antigen eventually eliminating it natural passive immunity is the type passed in the form of antibodies from a mother to her fetus across the placenta or to her infant through her milk passive immunity will only be effective for a short period of time artificial immunity is an immune response that develops as a result of deliberate exposure to a specific antigen the immunity acquired through vaccination as a reaction to a vaccine is known as artificial active immunity let's look at how a vaccine functions when pathogens such as bacteria or a virus enter the body white blood cells called lymphocytes or b cells recognize them as antigens and produce specific antibodies to fight them this process is known as an immune response and the antibodies will destroy the antigens the antibodies will also remain in the body to fight future infections a vaccine is designed to mimic the pathogen or antigen when vaccinated the immune system responds by producing antibodies for that particular antigen this is a primary immune response along with antibodies memory cells are also produced and are stored in bone marrow if antigens invade again memory cells will recognize them and quickly produce antibodies to combat them this is a secondary immune response vaccines are antigens but sometimes antibodies are administered directly to fight infections or prevent diseases such as malaria and rabies the administration of antibodies is referred to as passive artificial immunity and like passive immunity it only lasts for a short time summary an immune response is produced when an antigen enters the body active immunity is a response to the antigens passive immunity occurs when antibodies are administered to an individual